One of the easiest ways to know an amateur mix is with the vocal delay. There are some songs you just hear, you can hear the delay overshadowing the main vocals, like that echo, you can hear the bounce swallowing the main vocal. Let me show you how to get a clean vocal mix that you won't have that delay or echo issue. So I'll come right here to the main vocals, okay? Create a send, always create a send, do not load it up directly. So in my lead vocals, I'll create a send right here. Now I'll come to the inserts. Then I'm going to come to Fruity Delay Plugin. And I'm going to do my typical settings, right? Most times I like to have it at first step delay, dry to wet, 100% wet by bringing it down. So when I press play, go, go, go below. I like it. You can see here the vocals echoing, right? So I'm going to come right here. Still on this delay send, I'm going to come to Fruity Limiter. I'm going to come to Comp. On that side chain, you right click and then you come to lead vocals. And then you're going to adjust the threshold. After adjusting the threshold, the next most important button you need to adjust is the knee. If I take it up, go, go, go below. I like it the way you move. Sexy, 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 rose, oh, oh. If I relax it, go, go, go below. I like it. And then finally, use an EQ to shape the delay effect. So I'm going to come right here, take away some low end and some high end. Go, go, go below. I like it the way you move. Sexy, 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 a rose, oh, oh. She making me to lose on my mind, oh. And that's one of many ways to get a clean vocal delay in FL Studio. And if you want to learn more on how to mix and master professionally, come in the world course. If you're seeing this on Instagram, or go to our website, sctutorials.com, and sign up for our online mixing and mastering course so you become a much better mixing engineer. Cheers.